All right, so we have UFC 5 first look trailer. Let's go to the video. Now, UFC 5 is coming out, I think, this year Step or next year. Octagon is a fully immersive experience. Uh, Daniel Cormier. All at once, it becomes you, and it comes at you. That's the authentic feeling of mixed martial arts we've been working to capture. And with EA Sports UFC 5, this is as real as it gets. For the first time in franchise history, UFC 5 is powered by the Frostbite engine. Oh, wow. And with the Frostbite engine, UFC 5 looks amazing, man. It really gave me those feelings of stepping into the cage. The Frostbite engine makes a significant impact on the quality of characters and environments. With advanced rendering features, I wonder we can if they deliver get, like, even face more scan. realistic looking fighters with industry leading facial animation technology. Okay, yeah, yeah, I know it. Uh, yeah, I know it. While they get like, fa like face scans and stuff like that. Right? It's something to behold. It does come with consequences. Hey! And I can tell you, those consequences are nasty. With UFC oh 5's God. all new real impact system, cuts, bruising, and swelling accumulate in accurate locations on the body and have a realistic effect on gameplay. That all starts with the foundation oh. of the real impact system, authentic damage. Ooh. Damage impacts your fighter's Ooh. attributes during the game. So, if you got a cut bleeding into your eye, it will lower your defensive abilities on that side of the body. And if you take one too many kicks to your lead leg, you'll start to limp, your mobility will decline, and your attack I mean, so they kind of already did that for like die. UFC 4, right? Now, taking some cap kicks. With the they whole like little limb thing, in the game as they are in the like if you keep kicking the left leg, the left leg's gonna go out. Is the all new strategic element of doctors' checks and stoppages. If you take serious damage, the ref might call in the doctor to check on you. Once you're cleared to keep fighting, you're going to have to switch up your strategy to protect that hurt area. Oh, to keep the snap, fight so from getting stopped. The and doc the will come in and point, check me. Can you make the most of your opponent's injury? Oh, if that's a lame way to go out, though, right? I mean, I, I don't know, bro. I don't know about that one. Just as fun to tangle on the ground. We got a new seamless submission system, and it really legitimizes the ground game in UFC 5. The seamless submission system removes the mini games completely and functions as an extension of the overall ground game. Oh. This delivers a much faster and far more intuitive experience keeping the action on the ground fresh and fluid showcasing Ooh. ufc's massive Wait, so you instantly tap out if you get to the uh, to the submission is the all-new cinematic ko replay thanks to the power of frostbite players can now re-watch the finishing blows in stunning visual fidelity oh my god those super slow motion finishing with all those cinematic camera angles and lighting it really turns your knockout into a work of art plus We've added improved interactions with the referee in ground and pound stoppages and added oh, the ability oh, to, go to draw off. on the judges' scorecards in online play, which is something we know you've been asking for. UFC 5 is truly an extension of the UFC fan experience, thanks to Fight Week. An all-new series of features and challenges synced with real-world fight events that bring you more content and rewards than ever before. Like the all new alter egos. Bruce Lee! Which let you play as your favorite fighters in their authentic career defining moments. With up to four new alter egos dropping per month. Johnny? It's a staggering level of content. Career Mode offers an all new introduction. And Coach Davis is back to guide the player through their UFC career, along with help from none other than the bullet herself, Valentina Shevchenko. Who crushes it as an all new NPC? This is the best training facility in the world. There is no place like it. Then there are new cinematics, uh. locations, and a refined focus on onboarding. And last but not least, Connor. Trust me, it's not least. Hey. If you pre order UFC 5, you'll receive a roster of legendary heavyweight fighters, including Muhammad Ali, Mike Tyson, uh -oh. and the last emperor, Fedor Emelianenko. Where's Fedor? Butterbean? Come on, man. That's too good. Thanks for joining us, DC. But yeah, Mike Ty bro, Mike Tyson about to have a 99. <laughs> find out for yourselves that UFC 5 is as real as it gets. Bro. First of all, Mike Tyson on this cover, look, he, he looks pretty cool as a cover. Bro, Mike Tyson finna have a, a 99 striking, bro. You know these boxers about to have a 99 just strike. <laughs> Other than that, man, it, it looks pretty cool, bro. Um, I would say that. You know, and here's my thing, right? When it comes down to the, I'll get to the whole, um, to the doctor thing a, a little bit after this. But um, one thing I want to say about like just gaming in general is, like I, like we're getting to the point to where you know a lot of games are like 
trying to look as real as possible. And I feel like uh, obviously GTA 5 made the, made everybody do that. Like ever since GTA 5 came out with the graphics for for the PS3 and Xbox 360, and it was looking insane, bro. I think GTA made everybody switch up their game. It made everybody just it, it, yeah, they made everybody think twice. Okay, um, obviously GTA wasn't the only game, but GTA definitely made a huge huge impact whenever it comes to like you know um, like uh, graphic like graphics and stuff like that, right? Um, now, even though like you have a game and you try to make the game look as, look as real as possible, that can also be a problem, bro. Because I don't like, <laughs> I don't want to like get to a point to where, bro, like I'm playing, let's say, a Mortal Kombat game or a UFC game, right? And I'm fighting, bro, and like, you know, it's cool and it's fun, but like the graphics look so real that that like it becomes uncomfortable like it becomes like not you know not like good to look at <laughs> like at the end of the day i just hope that video games stay video games does that make sense and i understand like you know everybody's trying to make everything like look 4k you can see the pimples on their face all this and all that right which is good but at the same time though for some games it can get really like brutal bro like if you so, like if you have like a really like blood like bloody gory game and me i'm not really like, i can see like blood I'm, i don't get freaked out when i see blood i don't get freaked out when i see like gore like bro i play mortal Kombat, bro like i like bro i'm doing I'm, I'm i'm looking at all types of fatalities and stuff like that like you know i'm not really afraid of none of that it's just i hope it doesn't get to a point to where you know we're in the future we're in like 2066 and the graphics are, um, and the graphics are 64K, and everybody, look, it, 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 it looks like I, I'm in the game getting punched by Mike Tyson, you know, and, and like my face is all bloody and scratched up, and like, bro, no, <laughs> like, bro, that would, <laughs> bro, that would be ridiculous, bro, that that that'll be scary, bro. <laughs> That would be scary, bro. If the graphics are like 64K, bro. I can see like every little black mole on my face. And I'm getting absolutely rocked by uh, by Johnny Bones. Like, bro, that would be ridiculous. But um, that's one. The other thing is the whole doctor thing. Um, so I, I think he said that the ref can stop the fight and the doctor can come in and check about your cuts and stuff like that. Bro, I just feel like that's a boring way to end the fight, if I'm being honest. You know, so imagine like, you know... Um, I'm just taking hits, da 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 and, you know, even though I'm this close to a knockout, um, you know, this guy put a, a, a cut above my eye, whatever, let's just say that, and then doctor, the doctor will come in and be like, uh, mm, I don't know, mm, you know what, ref, let's end the fight, no, 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 I'll, listen, I will die in that octagon, I will, I will die for that. Well, you guys know what I mean, right? Like that would be like a lame way to like end the fight, in my opinion. I don't know if that, I don't know if that's just me, but other than that, um, hope you guys enjoyed this UFC Five first look trailer. Um, I'm excited to see more trailers uh, about the game. I don't know when this game will, will uh, actually come out, but uh, I'm actually excited for the game to come out. So comment down below what you guys think. I'll see you guys later for next time I'm out and.